The picture order packets are being handed out today and that means school picture day is near. We'll have the details ahead. And we'll have yesterday's sports results. All this and more coming up on KFOI Daily News. Good morning, Fort Osage High School. I'm Michaela Zimmer. And I'm Sydney Martin. Today is Thursday, August 28th, 2014. And here are today's news and announcements. School Picture Day is September 4th. You should have received order packets today in your language arts class. In the event that you are absent on Picture Day, or if you do not like your photos, retakes are scheduled for October 1st. This is the photo that is also used in the yearbook. So make sure you're following the dress code for your photo setting. A good time to visit with recruiters is at the upcoming college fair. More than 40 colleges, universities, and groups will be at the school on September 18th from 6.30 to 8 p.m. in the practice gym. Mark your calendars now. Students can now order yearbooks in PA7. They are $57 until Thanksgiving. You can add a nameplate for the total of $62 until Thanksgiving as well. Then, the price for a regular book is $62, and no nameplates can be ordered after Thanksgiving. You can get a book for the regular price of $57 with a free nameplate if you order on School Picture Day, September 4th. Books go up to $67 after May 1st, so get your order in early. We'll have more announcements for you after this word from our sponsors. Lunar Bowl is a great location for your club's team building events and recreation. Lunar Bowl offers a conference room for meetings and bowling in an arcade for fun and relaxation. Take a break from the school and motivate your club with a fun event at Lunar Bowl. Lunar Bowl is located at 2001 Northwest 7 Highway in Blue Springs. To book your team building event, call Group Sales Manager Tina Short at 816-220-7722. That's 220-7722 or online at LunarBowl.com. Lunar Bowl is a smoke-free facility. And seniors, don't forget the last chance to get your portrait taken for the yearbook will be Monday, September 15th from 8 to 10 a.m. Seniors who still need their photo taken will report to PA7 at the time you are scheduled. Please bring your $10 sitting fee, and this is the only place you can have it done. Roland Studios is completely booked and has no available appointment times, so seniors don't miss this opportunity to be included in the yearbook. See Ms. Smith in PA7 for details. The following colleges and universities are visiting the school in the near future. The University of Missouri will be here on September 22nd at 9.30 a.m. Central Methodist University is here on September 24th at 1.30 p.m. And William Woods University will be here on September 29th at 10.30 a.m. Stop by the Counseling Center to make arrangements to visit these college representatives. For a complete listing of upcoming college visits, see the scholarship bulletin in each teacher's room and pick up a copy in the Counseling Center. Now here's today's weather report. Welcome back for the weather today. Current conditions, it's about 74 degrees and it's going to feel about 77. It's going to be hot and humid and warm. You're going to see some suns and cloud. For today's forecast, it's going to be 89 degrees, but it's going to feel about 95 and it's going to be very hot and humid. Tonight, our lows are going to be 71. It's going to feel about 67 and it's going to be humid, but it's going to be cool. For tomorrow's conditions, it's going to be 82 degrees and feel like 85 with a couple of thunderstorms in our viewing. As you can see, the storms are kind of missing us, but they're going from like Wichita up through the upper state of Missouri. Starting Saturday, it's going to be about 86 and through our weekend, and it's going to stay in the 80s. Until Wednesday, it's going to be 89. It's going to be very close to 90, and make sure you're hydrating all through this weekend. Thanks for watching. Now back to the sports with Sydney. The Indian varsity softball team finished play in the Greater Kansas City Tournament yesterday. The Indians lost to Pleasant Hill 7-4. Multiple hits came from Lauren Schlutzbaum, Stormy Smallwood, Paige Hayden, and Paige James. The team is 1-4 on this season. The girls varsity and JV tennis teams beat the Bears of William Chrisman yesterday. 
Both teams won 7-2. Varsity single victories came from Artie Church, Elizabeth Shade, Jessica Wiley, and Michaela Ford. All three varsity doubles teams won their matches. And JV singles victories came from Bailey Buck, Kate Nelson, Brianna Everts, and Bailey Brown. All three JV doubles teams won their matches as well. Both teams are 2-0 in match play. Coming up on today's Indian sports calendar, the girls varsity and JV tennis teams have their home opener today against Raymore Peculiar starting at 4 p.m. The vo volleyball teams also have their openers against Raytown South. The freshman and JV squads play at 5.30 and the varsity square off against the Cardinals at 7. The boys soccer teams open their season at home against Ruskin. The JV kick off at 5 p.m. and the varsity at 7. Come out and support your Indians. That's all we have for you today on KFOI Daily News. Thanks for watching and have a great day.